What's up, Internet? We have a discount code from AliExpress for you guys, and it's just super simple to use. Number one, you need to buy more than $5 worth, but that includes already shipping. And then you get $4 off. Number two, this needs to be your first order from AliExpress. Number three, the code is good up to December 31, 2020, so you can use it. If you do use the code, we do get a small commission, so thanks very much if you do use it. Sa mga kapalit kong Pilipino, pasensya na po, hindi to available sa atin dito sa Pinas. Unfortunately, may mga specific countries lang na pwede mag-avail nitong promo code na to. Di tayo kasama doon. Pero kung may mga balikbayan kang mga pamilya or mga kaibigan, let's say sa UAE or sa Canada or sa UK, France, Germany, Italy, the, yung list of countries nandito sa video description, uh, yun, magagamit nila yun. So, kung tingin mo, magagamit nila, uh, useful naman, pa-forward naman sa kanila. Thank you. Alright, so this is my first time on AliExpress and let's see what weird stuff we can find. Um, uh, so, do they have anything interesting? So, it's really a grab bag. I mean, you have lots of different stuff. Like, this, this, is this tint? Alright, let's look for the interesting stuff. Alright, let's go to computers, hardware sugar, the computer store. See what kind of stuff we can find. The Kingston SSD is always, uh, you know, it, you can find it a lot. Alright, but that's boring. We have Wi Fi extenders for a hundred bucks. Wow. Alright, let's look for, since everybody is looking for these things. Yeah, there we go. AliExpress knows what it's about. Okay, you can get an RTX. What's this? This is a 3080 for $1,673. I like how it knows I'm in the Philippines, or I don't know if, um... I don't know if this is just the image they display to everybody, but the uh, first one in the Philippines, RTX 3080. The brand is iPason. The price is, well, it's a lot, but it is a 3080. So actually, I think this is a good price already. Uh, they have other stuff. Only 3000 series, NVIDIA 3000 series card. Very powerful PC and seller is the very, is the best. Very excellent communications. Hmm, kind of odd though. The reviews are from July and May. And yet, it has an RTX 3080 card. Hmm. Although there is some explanation. We newly launched the new 3080 in stock. Don't ask me if I have 3080 or not. I really have 3080. It's actually just remind me of some customers we have to deal with online where they're very annoying when they keep asking, do you have this card? Do you have this card? And things like that. Okay, what else do we got? Is that the only R 3000 series card? iPason also has a 3070. Ah, well, at least here we have a le legit brand. We have Asus stuff. Asus with their tough line for 900 bucks, 3070. Only 10 left, so they are indicating that it is in stock. When I'm filming this, the new AMD Ryzen's have just come out, the 5000 series. So let us see what they have. Oh. Oh, shit. I think it's Ryzen 7. Okay, let's get the latest and the greatest. Let's get the R9 5 900X. No? I don't know. What else do I want to try? I, actually, I have a solar panel at home and our inverter... The manufacturer of our inverter just went out of business. So now I'm a bit concerned, like, if I need to replace the inverter, what's going to happen? So... We Google Solar Inverter. Oh, you know what? Better. There are options. Um, so basically, this is for storing. You have a solar setup at home and you generate excess power. Instead of selling it back to your grid, your local distributor, you can store it. And so that's what the Tesla Powerwall does. And this guy as well for $2,700. So I have no idea if this is a good one or a bad one, even based on price. Sophie's Game Shop. Wow, and <laughs> Sophie's Game Shop sells all like the old school stuff. But they have a lot of foreign ones. These must be like knockoffs. Um, 
I don't think you know they made these actual five in ones officially. So there are still people selling for the Sega Genesis. I mean, oh, and then you have um for the SNES. Sorry, this is for the Sega Mega Drive. Damn. Wow, is this for the Famicom? Is this for the family computer? 8-bit? Could be. Who is still buying these things? Oh, this is for Nintendo. This is for the NES. And here we have the SNES. Secret of Mana 2. Wow, for 845. Man, who... <laughs> Who is still buying these things? Game card with manual and retail box. Oh, so it's a complete experience. Are people buying this to play or to collect? Divine ceiling. With box and manual. What game is divine ceiling? I don't even know what language this is. Is this Thai? Is this script Thai? I don't even know what game this is. <laughs> oh, and I think we got punted. Oh no, it's still Sophie's Game Shop. Okay. But not in English anymore. Actually, I'm a big Battlestar. <laughs> so, Battlestar Galactica Lego. I'm a big BSG fan. You can see where this is going. Oh, this is a scene from um, Rogue One, I think. So, definitely though, not uh, not an official Lego set. Yeah, this is the one where they're hovering over the city. Looks pretty good, actually, but this is not an official Lego set. I wonder how big this is. Oh, they do have the... Superstar Destroyer, Executor class. Oh, I I want to click, but it won't let me click. I do have a very nice Tantive Four from the latest UCS. Uh, so this isn't Lego. Uh, it's O Twenty One or whatever this is. Uh, so this is not licensed by Lucas <laughs> Films. Oh, they even have a Nebulon B frigate. This one you can click on. Oh, this one looks pretty good, actually. They have it on a... So they have the Falcon curved. Or, you know, it's sort of like in mid-turn. Oh, they have a Tidarian shuttle. That doesn't look bad. Uh, what did we search for? Oh, yeah, Battlestar Galactica. Unfortunately, they do not have BSG. But it's weird now how it's from right to left all of a sudden. What's going on AliExpress? Nice. They have a Viper. What is this? The model that you assemble? Oh, they have a Cylon Raider. They have a BS. I'm not sure. It, uh, it looks like a model. <laughs> not sure what this one is. Okay, now we're now we've gone down the rabbit hole. So you got a rebel speeder, you got an X-wing, you got the cockpit of the Falcon. Uh, this looks like the Reliant from uh, Wrath of Khan. You have the original Enterprise, the movie version. You'll notice the nacelles aren't the circular ones like in the TOS. And this is Voyager, I think. It does look like Voyager. Um, can't even tell like are these die cast? Are they plastic? <laughs> this is this is a really interesting viper. Uh, it even says police on the side. Nine one one. That's <laughs> definitely not an official issue. Viper. Do your own research, obviously, before buying. Um happy shopping. <laughs> 